Typically after one of their earliest songs blows up, one-hit wonders find it hard to follow up with a record impressive or catchy enough to maintain that hype, which typically results in them falling off right after. So today we're going to be looking at the one-hit wonder CJ and seeing what he is up to nowadays after he released his hit song, Whoopty. Before we get to his story, I'm trying to get to 1,000 subs by the end of the month. So if you could hit that subscribe button quick, it would mean a lot. Now let's get into it. CJ is a rapper who many know for his song, Whoopty, and literally nothing else. People literally refer to him as CJ, Whoopty, because they don't know any other songs from him. So CJ began his rap career as a kid and started posting music to YouTube and SoundCloud when he was just 14 years old. He released a handful of songs over the years and saw a little buzz after he likely paid for a 69 feature for the song Pop in 2018. So that's what I'm saying. That's, that's, that's my story. People think that the Whoopty song was my first song that I ever made and I just blew up. Nah, you gotta do your research. I gotta do your homework. I, I've been doing this for years, 10 years plus. I just happened to create Whoopty and it happened to be the song that blew up. But other than that little bit of information, he was relatively unknown and hardly had much music out. Until, of course, he released his drill song, Whoopty, in July of 2020. This song was a smash hit, blowing up on YouTube and TikTok. It featured a catchy hook and a sample that had already been used by drill legend, Pop Smoke, King Vaughn, FBG Duck, and more. The YouTube video has over 450 million views, and the song itself went two times platinum. Shortly after the virality of this song, he signed a deal with Warner Records. He followed up Whoopty with the song Bop, which did all right, and then released his album, Loyalty Over Royalty, which did not perform well at all when compared to his previous hit. With single after single, CJ was struggling to replicate the success he saw with Whoopty until he eventually parted ways with Warner Records. We had our differences with the label and um, you know, we decided to part ways. I'm gonna leave it at that. But I do want to clarify a lot of people who aren't doing so hot, like to rephrase being dropped by their label as parting ways or having disagreements. It's very possible that CJ was dropped, although Yassine even claimed that he was dropped, but I'm not sure how accurate that is. Regardless, things started going downhill for CJ for a couple of reasons. One of the main reasons that he couldn't replicate his success was because he just jumped on a trend. A Reddit user explained fairly well why Whoopty blew up like it did and why he couldn't create a hit like it again. They said, Whoopty came out 2020, months after Pop Smoke died. Keeping it a grand, after Pop Smoke died, people were desperate for another drill star. That's why that shit, plus Dusty Locaine's shit, got millions of views quick. And that was their first songs. After Pop Smoke died, one of the most popular drill artists, there was a huge longing for more hard-hitting, aggressive drill songs, and people began trying to fill that void. Whoop D was literally made off of Pop Smoke type beat. So it's pretty obvious what market CJ was trying to dip his toes into. It was actually his first drill song. There was also another controversy going on with CJ where many people were accusing him of being a fake gangster. I'm not going to go too much into detail about this, but a lot of people lost respect for CJ because of this. On the comments of that interview with DJ Academics, people were saying things like, he basically realized he isn't about that life and he regrets riding the drill wave. And problem with rap is, you can't be fake street. Once it's exposed, it's over. He's basically the Spanish Slim Jesus. Since all of this went down, CJ hasn't released any music of his own since January of 2023. He hasn't posted on Instagram since then, other than a few IG stories here and there. So for now, it looks like CJ has gone MIA. He does have a very young career though, so the chance of him making a comeback is definitely possible. But what do you guys think? Can he make a comeback? Comment down below what you think about it.